My friend was recently killed by one of the only two other players in the server in Krasno Air Base. I'm hauling ass five kilometers north to go get some revenge. Mind you, there's a server wipe that's about to occur here, and I don't know if the wipe commences on the midnight mark of next day, but we're approaching about 15 minutes to midnight, so we want to get that loot secured. Oh, big player lag. So what I just called there, uh, I called that player lag, that, that's a much more different feeling than it is whenever you're loading a town, let's say, or a forest. Uh, it, it feels much more abrupt, it's much more obvious feeling. It's essentially the inventory of another player loading within your vicinity. So it's basically indicating this man is still alive. Now mind you, every player encounter I've ever had, most of the times I mess up because I either panic too much or I, you know, I choke up. So this is a really good example of being lucky, essentially. So if you see that tent just ahead of me, keep in mind that is not supposed to be there. Got him. That all happened really fast, so let's get a replay here. Essentially, I opened up the, the tent, and he appears to be almost ready for me, but also at the same time not quite ready for me. Like, he's standing, but he wasn't in the ready as if he was aiming. Maybe he was still trying to figure out what I was doing, where I was. You could also see how panicked I was in my shots. Of course, I wasn't ready for him to be there. I was spraying all over the place, it was a hip fire, so it was it was pure luck that he didn't have all his shots on me. What a fucking The reason for all the overkill shots here is because he my buddy reported that he shot him many times in on the chest or face area and he didn't go down. And actually came back up after going down, passing out. So, I just wanted to make sure he was in fact so neutralized. Did he go down or after getting shot? I'm on top of his face, don't worry. Okay. I currently have my eye on his him. mouth. No, he's not moving. Not... I shot him so many times. Okay, I'm basically at the airport right now. Okay. Uh, okay. So now it's a mad dash for basically stealing any new loot that he had on him, which was a lot of AK rounds and mags and other stuff, as well as trying to regain my buddy's loot that might have been mismatched or thrown about, and essentially just getting everything back in bags. So here I find my friend, telling him to get his ass over here, because we're about five minutes from midnight, if not less, and as soon as we get our stuff, we're out of here. I, I had not a good feeling at this point, I just wanted to go. I just wanted to go, and this is a very important thing. Whenever you get a gut feeling, listen to it. You'll see why in a few seconds. And you didn't have a crate on you, did you? No. Okay. No, I, I threw everything in my backpack. Oh, uh, I'm gonna need to do now. Are you flashing? Yeah. Shit. So here's a great reason why I like to re-watch my recordings. Yeah. That was where the gunshot came from. We were so tunnel visioned that we didn't even realize how close the threat actually was. Yeah. And in doing so, we actually just decided to panically run and decide to log off. I thought he was much further than that. He must have watched us this whole time. I don't know how we didn't die. I honestly have no idea. This was so lucky. All of this was so luck based. Are you okay? Did you take any hits? I'm logging off now. Three, two. Alright, I'm safe. <laughs> Nine, Did we really just take a third person and start seven, coming in then? Six, five, four, three, two, one. Right. Oh my god. That was intense. I just want to say thank you. <laughs> just imagine if I didn't tell us to get the fuck out of there. <laughs> So remember this the next time you feel bad about dying in a gunfight. It truly is mostly luck based. I mean the skill of the gunfight itself can get you out of a situation, but the luck of actually either seeing someone first or them seeing you, it's just, you gotta watch the signs around you. Anyways, I know I don't do videos like this often, but uh, I hope you enjoyed this and uh, I'll be making more. I'm gonna enjoy making Daisy content, so uh, keep watching if you like it, if not, hey, so be it. To each our own. Have a nice night, morning, wherever the hell you are, however you are, goodbye.